The proof you provided is a classic demonstration of the irrationality of the square root of 2. It's a proof by contradiction, a common technique in mathematics. Here's a summary of the key steps. Assume the square root of 2 is rational. This means we can write it as a fraction of over b in lowest terms. Square both sides. This gives us 2 equals a squared over b squared. Deduce a squared is even, since 2 is even, a squared must also be even. Therefore, a is even. If a squared is even, a must be even. Substitute a equals 2k. We can write a as 2k, where k is another integer. Simplify the equation. Plugging a equals 2k into 2 equals a squared over. b squared leads to b squared equals 2k squared. Deduce b squared is even, similar to step 3, b squared must be even. Therefore, b is even, similar to step 4, b must be even. Contradiction. We initially assumed a over b was in lowest terms, but now we've shown both a and b are even. This is a contradiction. Conclusion. Since our assumption led to a contradiction, the square root of 2 cannot be rational. Therefore, it must be irrational.